you guys remember the first print I did on this machine? It was a little square I sliced up. Well, this is print number two. If you're gonna dive in the water, you might as well go in the deep end, right? This is a Tom Cruise model by a modeler named Sid Nequi. Uh, it does nice models and, and I print nice models. Sun Lu T3. Very smooth. There's a little color change in the plastic, which is uh, unusual with this plastic. I don't know. I gotta talk to the manufacturer and see why. There's another little color change there, too. Typically, I don't have these problems. Uh, this is an example of another plastic. You see, there's no, no color banding, so you gotta find out why that happened. Anyways, I think this came out very good. I'll peel off the supports, take some beauty shots in a little while, and uh, move on to the next thing. Don't know what I want to do yet next, but you notice I print my heads upside down. Uh, that way you have no support contacts on your face area, you know. You don't want to be pulling supports out of his nose, out of his uh, bottom of his chin, you know. You'd rather have those things come out very nice. Even the eye, eye, eyelids, eyebrows sometimes, you know, you got supports coming up, you got to deal with all that stuff, so think out of the box sometimes, you know. If you look through this group, you'll find uh, some of my older posts, I don't know when it goes back, probably two or three years now, when I was using the S8 printer and you can see I was doing some pretty good stuff back then so it's all about the profile sometimes this is the uh, fat dragon game profile you can find that online and uh, I don't think there's really any adjustments you need to do with your printer either it works for Cura just set it up as the uh, Ender 3 and I mean this is basically all the same style hardware so I shouldn't have any problems with that alright I'll get these supports off and we'll take some pictures take care happy printing <laughs>